we're tracking behind Italy, we're following the same sort of path, what do I expect to see happen? I think this week's difficult, I think this week we're going to see a further increase. Thereafter, we should see a plateau as the effects of the social distancing come through. That plateau may last for some time and then begin to decrease. That's what we'd expect to see in this very unfortunate uh, death curve. We're now at a stage when you can begin to see the flattening. We'll look and see where the peak is and when we are firmly the other side of it in terms of numbers coming down. Only at that stage do you start looking at what measures might be released and how they might be released. It would be a complete waste of everything that everyone's had to do till now. And I absolutely understand the difficulties that some of the decisions make. But it would be a waste if we were to rapidly reverse that and lead to a re-emergence of this. We're still not past the peak of this virus. So please, continue to follow the advice now more than ever to stay home, save lives and protect our NHS. This week, SAGE will review the evidence of the effectiveness of the social distancing measures that we've taken and we will consider their evidence, uh, their assessment, based on the evidence at that point. I should say we don't expect to make any changes to the measures currently in place at that point, and we won't until we're confident, as confident as we realistically can be, that any such changes can be safely made.